Imagine having a rock-solid core in those chiseled abs you've always dreamed of. It's time to turn this dream into reality. Welcome to the 30-Day Abs Challenge, a transformative journey designed to sculpt your core and reveal those coveted six-pack abs. The core is more than just your abs. It's the powerhouse of your body, the epicenter of strength and stability. A strong core doesn't just mean toned abs, it means better balance, improved posture, and a reduced risk of injuries. This challenge is not just about aesthetics, it's about enhancing your overall fitness and well-being. Over the next 30 days, we'll tackle a series of targeted ab exercises that will ignite your core muscles like never before. From the classic plank that tests your endurance to the Russian twist that works on your obliques, we've got a variety of moves to keep your muscles guessing and your body transforming. Now you might be wondering, what makes this challenge different? Well, it's not just about doing 100 crunches a day. This challenge is designed to work every single muscle in your core, from the rectus abdominis in the front to the erector spinae in the back. It's comprehensive, it's intense, and it's effective. But let's not forget, consistency is key. This challenge requires commitment. Some days will be harder than others. There might be moments when you feel like giving up. But remember, every rep, every bead of sweat brings you one step closer to your goal. The road to transformation is not easy, but it's worth it. And don't worry, you're not alone in this journey. We're in this together. Every crunch, every plank, every twist. Each day, we'll be here, guiding you, supporting you, pushing you to reach your potential. So gear up, fitness warriors, for this transformative journey to sculpt your abs. Ready to fire up those abs muscles? Day 1 to Day 10 is all about laying the foundation. We're kicking off this fitness journey with a bang, focusing on core exercises that will build strength and stability. Our first stop is the classic plank. Remember, form is essential. Keep your elbows directly beneath your shoulders, your body straight as an arrow, and hold for 30 seconds. Do this three times with a 30-second rest in between. Day 2 introduces the bicycle crunch. Lie flat with your hands behind your head, then alternate bringing your elbow to the opposite knee. Aim for three sets of 15 reps each. Feel that burn? That's your core thanking you. Day 3 is a rest day. Yes, you heard it right. Rest is crucial for muscle recovery, so take this day to stretch and hydrate. Day 4, we're back with a vengeance. This time it's leg raises. Lie flat, then lift your legs up and down without touching the ground. Three sets of 10 reps should do the trick. On day 5, we're mixing it up with Russian twists. Sitting on the floor, lean back slightly, lift your feet, and twist from side to side. Try for three sets of 20 reps. Day 6 and 7 are rest days. Use this time to recharge and prepare for the next round of exercises. Day 8 brings us the mountain climber. Assume a high plank position, then alternate bringing your knees to your chest. Three sets of 20 should get your heart racing. Day 9 sees us back to the plank but this time we're upping the ante. Try to hold for 45 seconds, three times. Finally, day 10 wraps up with a combination of all the exercises. Do each exercise for one set, then repeat the cycle twice. Great job on completing the first phase, keep up the momentum as we progress to more challenging workouts. Now that your core is ignited, it's time to push your limits from day 11 to day 30. We're ramping up the intensity folks because remember, progress lives outside of your comfort zone. From day 11 to day 20, we'll be increasing the repetitions of our core exercises. That's right, more planks, more Russian twists, more abdominal burn, but trust me, it's all part of the path to those chiseled abs. Now, let's talk form. It's crucial to maintain proper form throughout these exercises to maximize results and prevent injury. With each plank, keep your body in a straight line, from your head to your heels. When performing Russian twists, ensure your spine is straight, and twist from your core, not your shoulders. As we move into the final 10 days, we're introducing some advanced moves to really challenge your core. Get ready for reverse crunches and bicycle crunches. Oh, and did I mention more planks? But these aren't your regular planks, we're stepping it up a notch with side planks and plank jacks. Remember, these advanced exercises are designed to push you, but it's important to listen to your body. If you need to take a break, do it. Hydrate, breathe, and jump back in when you're ready. And don't be discouraged if you can't do as many reps as you'd like initially. Consistency is key, and every rep gets you one step closer to your fitness goals. Let's finish strong, folks. These last few days are all about pushing past your perceived limits and realizing just how much you're capable of. Remember, your mind will give up a thousand times before your body will, so keep pushing, keep striving, and keep surprising yourself. 
Congratulations on completing the 30-day abs challenge, but don't stop here. We have another exciting challenge waiting for you. Let's keep this fitness journey going because remember, the only way to truly fail is to quit. So, are you ready to keep crushing those fitness goals? Let's do this. Ready to take your cardio game to the next level? It's time to hit the pavement with interval running. Interval running, for those who are new to the term, is a type of cardiovascular training that alternates between high and low intensity running periods. By switching up your pace during a run, you can maximize your workout's efficiency and push your body's limits in a safe and controlled manner. So why should you incorporate interval running into your fitness routine? The answer is simple. It's a game changer for speed and endurance. When you challenge your body to sustain high intensity efforts, followed by recovery periods, you train your cardiovascular system to work more efficiently. This can translate into faster running speeds and longer endurance, helping you go the extra mile, literally and figuratively. But there's more. Interval running is also a fantastic way to torch calories. The intense bursts of effort raise your heart rate, creating an afterburn effect where your body continues to burn calories long after you've finished your workout. This makes it a powerful tool for weight loss and overall fitness. Now, let's talk about how to incorporate interval running into your routine. Start by warming up with a 5-minute jog. Then, transition into a sprint or high-intensity run for 30 seconds to a minute, depending on your fitness level. Follow this with a 1-2 minute recovery period of slow jogging or walking. Repeat these intervals for the duration of your run, and always end with a 5-minute cool-down jog. Remember it's essential to listen to your body and adjust the intensity and duration of your intervals accordingly. Start slow and gradually increase your effort as your fitness improves. Don't be discouraged if you find interval running challenging at first. It's supposed to be. But with consistency and determination, you'll soon notice improvements in your speed, stamina, and overall fitness. Lace up your sneakers, fitness warriors. It's time to sprint towards success. You've ignited your core and boosted your stamina. Let's recap on this transformative journey. Over the past 30 days, we've embarked on a thrilling adventure, challenging our bodies and our minds. We've sculpted our abs with targeted exercises from powerful planks to ruthless Russian twists, igniting our core muscles and carving out that coveted six-pack. We've pushed our cardio game to the next level with high-intensity interval running, torching calories and building endurance. We started slow, focusing on form and consistency. But as each day passed, we added more repetitions, increased intensity, and stepped up our pace. We didn't just run, we sprinted. We didn't just hold a plank, we moved, twisted and raised the bar. This journey wasn't just about the physical transformation though, it was about the mental grit, the determination, the willpower that drove us to get up each day, lace up our sneakers, and hit the pavement or the mat. It was about overcoming the voice in our heads that said, I can't, and replacing it with a resounding I can and I will. We've pushed our limits, we've unlocked our potential, and we've proven to ourselves that we are stronger, fitter, and more resilient than we ever thought possible. But remember, this is just the beginning. Fitness is a lifelong journey, not a destination, and there's always room to grow, to improve, to challenge ourselves further. So what's next? Keep going, keep challenging yourself. Try a new workout, increase your running speed, or add more repetitions to your AB exercises. And most importantly, celebrate your progress. Every sweat drop, every aching muscle, every moment of triumph, it's all a testament to your hard work and dedication. You are stronger than you think. Keep pushing, keep striving, and remember, every step you take is a step closer to your fitness goals. Until next time, fitness warriors, keep crushing it.